Glowing Titan Orbs, the rare material dropped by all Titans in the Dragon Isles. So come on in and take... Uh, no, not come on in. What is this, Mr. Rogers? Jesus, great. Glowing Titan Orbs, this rare crafting reagent dropped in the Dragon Isles from different Titans, is using the most expensive weapon enchants, the very high-end weapon enchants uh, that are most sought after. Sophic Devotion, Earthen, Wafting, all of these weapon enchants, we're gonna be taking three each. And let's get to the juicy part. These orbs, these orbs going for about four and a half thousand each. People will always need weapon enchants. They're always gonna be looking for the best ones. Once Raids and Mythic Plus come out next week, people are gonna be looking for the best weapon enchant possible. There are a couple places where you can farm these glowing titan orbs. The first one I'm gonna go over briefly is Uldaman. The Ebonstone Golem in Uldaman. I've been playing WoW for many years and I'll take any excuse to never visit that place again. So we're gonna just skip that one. But if you're feeling bold, you can go to Uldaman, farm, those Ebon farm the Ebonstone Golems. The first place I want to talk about though is the Life Vault Ruins from the Waking Shores, right here on this little like inlet. There's a mob called the Disoriented Watcher that you farm them, and there's a decent drop rate. Uh, I do know there's a short little quest line here to kind of awaken one, so you might have to do that in order for them to spawn, but I have done that on this character. So it, here is the spot right here, and they look like the Maiden of Virtue right here. Boom. Now they are fairly tanky. Now these are elite mobs, so they're gonna take a little longer to kill than just your normal uh, farming mobs, but the Disoriented Watcher is not very dangerous, so um, you can take him down pretty easily. Just, just gonna drop this, hopefully I can get that uh, <laughs> drop for the video. That would be nice. All right, 369 staff and some some rep. Outside of the Life Vault Ruins, there's another spot called Tear Hold that has a couple more of these Titan creatures. Tear Hold actually has more than the Life Vault Ruin, so the spawn's a little better and you can farm a couple more. The easiest one to kill here is going to be called the Malfunctioning Protector. So keep an eye out for those. And that's it. Just keep an eye out for those. Fuck. And this is what they look like. The Malfunctioning Protector. The reason why you want to farm these is because they're weak. Look at this. 300k health for an elite. Uh, very easy to kill. Don't get hit by that. And nothing. Well, unfortunate. These Titan Defense Matrix around here. These guys right here will spawn an unstable matrix core. If you get 20 of them, you can then spawn those ancient protectors. Um, ancient protectors also have a chance to drop them, but they're a little harder and I would do that in a group. So if you're solo farming, do not do that. But if you do have a group, um, that's an option. If you're enchanting like me, it has really helped with getting some of these uh, weapon enchants. So thank you for watching. As always, love you.